the Houston Rockets are a disaster right now of a basketball team. Um, they tried to release Carmelo Anthony. That wasn't a problem. We said that on my platform. Um, they're healthy. It's not working out. They've had to insert Eric Gordon in the starting lineup. Not working out. Their bench is depleted now. You know, tr losing Trevor Reza this summer was everything to that Rockets team. And not only just losing Trevor Reza, but I believe championship windows are a real thing. I believe the Rockets missed their championship window last year. When you lose to a Golden State Warriors team as good as they are, and Chris Paul is injured, he, you lose Chris Paul game six or seven, when you that close to getting to the NBA Finals, and they would have been the favorite in the Finals over the Cavs, it's depleting, it's demoralizing. Then for you to go into this summer, and the team that you were this close to beating, they got better. They added an all-star in DeMarcus Cousins. And y'all only re-signed Clint Capella? I think James Harden knows that the championship window for this team has closed. I don't believe James Harden ended the season with the same amount of work ethic that he gave last year. To me, he don't seem as focused. Um, I don't know what he did this summer, what he didn't do. I know he was around. I know he was active a lot. You know, but I'm not going to question that man's game. He's still one of the top five, top eight guys in the league. He ain't playing like it this year for the most part, in my opinion. Not the same amount of impact. A lot of worthless baskets. I mean, they're losing games that they should be winning right now. They won these games last year. You gave all these guys this money over the last two years. Harden's got paid. Chris Paul's got played. Paid. Clint Capella, he deserves some blame. He didn't got paid. The reason why you can't go out and get a guy, you know, is because you gave Clint Capella all that dang money. Where you at, Clint? Where your production at? Daryl Morey is too smart of a GM to just sit there and let this team sit up like this and rot. He knows that championship with, window with Chris Paul, ain't, it ain't long. And honest to God, truth, you know, I would consider trading Chris Paul at the deadline. I'm, a, I'm just being honest. Like, if this Rockets team is going to get... If you're going to be out of the playoff picture in the West come into January, like, if you couldn't get it done this year, what's going to change next year? Harden's your guy. He's your star. I would consider trading Chris Paul. Clay Capella. I don't think his value is that high. I would think about trading Chris Paul. Moving on. Trying to get me a younger point guard. See what's out there. See if, if, if James Harden can convince Kyrie to come to Houston. I don't know. Like, right now, right now, Rockets team not working out. They've missed their championship window. They had a chance. And it's gone now. And I don't believe there, a ch opportunity for this team to win a championship is going to open back up. They're a mess right now, and it's not turning around. It's not turning around. Christmas just ain't Christmas. Without the one you love. Oh, yo, where y'all come from? What's going on? It's yours truly, Vince the Delaferro. And it is the holiday season, and I'm in the giving mood. To be honest with y'all, y'all gave me over 60 million views this year. So give your darn self a pat on the back. Thank y'all so much for all the love y'all showed me. And I got to give back. Yeah, it's time to give y'all some of this energy that y'all been giving me in 2018. So I'm doing a giveaway. And guess what? Anyone's eligible to win some of this free stuff. All right? It's just that simple. There are no specific groups, no hidden. No, you can get this free stuff too, bro. I got a PlayStation in my lap. I actually got a couple PlayStations. I got all the games. I got a couple copies of all the games. We got all the hot games. I got some Amazon gift cards to my side. I got a, a TV or two maybe as well to give away. So this is my time to give you guys some love back. Thank y'all so much for y'all for y'all what y'all been showing me all year long. Now, here are the three simple things you gotta do to win this stuff. All right, you know there gotta be some rules. I just can't give this stuff away. I mean, I did pay for it. Number one, you gotta be subscribed to my YouTubes. It's Mr. Telefero and Ferro Reacts. You gotta be subscribed to the sports one as well to be in the running. We gonna fact check. We gonna make sure y'all show us some screenshots of y'all subscriptions, all right? Number two, you gotta be following my Instagram account, Mr. Telefero TV. We got sports, hip hop news every day on that bad boy. Number three, you can't just follow the account. 
you got to show some love to my Instagram. Make sure you like five posts. After you do those three things, we're going to randomly pick winners from Instagram. All right? We're going to randomly pick people who didn't like five posts on my Instagram, and we're going to hit you up and be like, yo, send me a screenshot of you subscribed to my YouTubes. Send me a screenshot of you following my Instagram, and we're going to go from there. We're going to pick random winners. I got somebody working on that during this holiday season. But yes, you can win some of this free stuff. I want to help some of these parents make their Christmas morning special for their kids. Kids, y'all can y'all eligible as well. Y'all can get in the running for this free stuff. Make sure y'all do those three steps. And some of this giveaway season glory will be yours. Christmas just ain't Christmas without the one you love. Happy holidays from yours truly, Mr. Telefero.